here. And uh, they tell me my name is Richie Niles Pollock. And I'm here tonight to have a wonderful time. That's what I spend most of my time doing, having a wonderful time. And let's see, I think what I would like to do like to start off with a little bit of oh, a little bit of spoken word because I know the real spirit of this place is grounded in spoken word. So I'll start off with this little little thing I wrote that will probably set the tone of this whole evening. It's called The Watcher. I'm watching I'm watching myself watching the world go by, seeing someone looking just like me, acting out soap opera scenes. I mean, it's all too unreal to believe. I mean, the world disappears when I've got my eyes closed. And when I'm in a dream, which world's real? I don't know. Here I am, watching it all so clear. My job is to show me that I'm really here. Who am I? It's a very good question. Where am I? That's a whole other lesson. You can call me the watcher, because I watch what you do. I'm a detached observer, but I really am you. I'm somewhere inside, looking out through your eyes. To the day you see no difference between you and I. We've all got a watcher sitting deep inside. He's the part of us we always feel when we cry over things unreal. He's always laughing and saying, big deal. But we'll keep taking ourselves so seriously, it becomes a habit keeping us from being free. But the watcher is above all pleasure and pain. I keep trying to remind me time and time again, who am I? That's the question. Where am I? It's a whole other lesson. Just call me the watcher, because I watch what you do. I'm a detached observer, but I really am you. I'm somewhere inside, looking out through your eyes, till the day you see no difference between you and I. And the watcher never judges. I just sit inside your soul. Let you make all the decisions, while I steer you towards your goal. Back in the good old days, I used to sing in the streets of Greenwich Village in New York City. Oh boy, oh boy. Wonderful and various experiences were had in the streets of New York City. But out of that came this song when someone told me in order to make it in music, you have to make them dance. Don't make them dance. You got no chance. So. I wrote a song called Give Love a Chance to Dance. I'm 